Laws in Southern New Jersey, the site for our championship fight. 12 rounds of heavyweight action. Boy, and we expect this to be a big night of action. We spoke with both fighters yesterday. Fireworks anticipated here tonight. Let's see. Razor's really keyed in for this one. You can see it as he makes his walk to the ring. for what's about to happen. This is a guy that is just relaxed and calm as can be, the task at hand, as he makes his way down to the ring. Okay guys, we went over the rules in the dressing room. Let's touch them up. Opening three minutes of this schedule is well grounded. This should be a very good test for The Razor's now facing the ultimate challenge for the fighter. His first chance to play the fight. And he's gotta be whispered in his ear a little bit. Right now we're looking at his quarterback that's out there, that's talking in his ear. They gotta be fine though. We've done it before, not the post, but the opposite. We've been on the big stage. We'll do it again. He missed with that headshot. Then the expectation of a matchup like this, a power puncher versus power puncher, is that the fight's not going to last long. But what if it does? Then what? The guy with less power is going to win. But he's a guy that has a reserve, a reserve in a place that he's ready to go to in case the power is not there. Solid, accurate shots and hooked by Razor. Well, what do they say, Teddy? Something's got to stick. That combination was something. Well, you know what it was? The first couple punches were throwaway punches. Set up the later punches. He fires off the hook. Look at that. Oh, now the uppercut. 
Haynes trying to erode away that body with the combination punch. That's a good sharp hook by Razor. And he returns on that exchange. And he just holds on there. Razor's controlling this fight right now. There's one main reason. His jab. Now he's an inside fighter, but his jab has been the reason he's had success. Thanks for being with us ringside and enjoy the rest of your evening.